Hey guys, welcome back to another video of Forza Street. How are we doing? Hope you guys are well. So what I want to do today is I do want to progress through the chapters, but what I also want to do first, which we're going to do, is I want to open a few things. So let's go ahead and do that today. As you can see, I've got a couple of red dots, but let's see what else I have. I've nearly got my free daily car reward as well, but unfortunately we won't get through to that one today, but I do want to open up a few things here and there and see what we get. What we do have over here is we've finally got enough um, uh, chips there to open up a muscle car card, which you, I am excited to open up, but also I've got a whole bunch of supers that I want to open up. So let's go ahead and open a few of these resources and I've got a ton of resources as you can see claim 21 times now I don't know if I'm gonna open up all of those I really want to show the cars today mainly and we may do a couple of races here or there so let's get to it let's go ahead and claim this been wanting to do this it's been sitting there it's a spotlight run it is also something that I can um, also muck around with, utilize and things like that. But there is a few other cars in there that I'm interested in. Mainly the M4 Beamer um, that I've got there. But if I do get the, uh, the RS, I'll be happy with that as well. So let's see what we get. Can I get no of? Anyway, that's cool. It's a Porsche. Nothing wrong with that. I've got a duplicated car now, which is cool. Let's go ahead and collect that. You do get bonuses with this as well, which is kind of neat. So I do like that. Um, I'm not too sure how far this is going to go. It's only going to go to level three. It's got a livery. That's cool. I'm happy with that. But disappointed I didn't get the, um, the RS. It is what it is. We got a modern street card, 900. And we got a tuning pack there, which is cool. And we got a few more of those modern sport chips, stage three tuning kit. So not a bad pickup, but disappointed I didn't get the RS. If I wanted to, I can spend some um, some coin in there and see if I can get one. But you know, is it worth it? I don't know. Let's go ahead and suss one out anyway, just to see if we do get one out of it. If we do, happy days. So let's go ahead and open her up. Let's see if we get lucky with this. I'm not too sure if I will, but. You don't know until you know. There you have it. Focus RS. Have a look at him. Awesome. Not bad. Now, honestly, there's only a few days left in this event here, so I don't know how much I'm going to get through this, but we'll see. It's a good little intro just to suss it out, but let's move on and claim up on these two here. I've nearly got enough chips there to make a third. Um, premium card opening so very very close with that to be honest with you let's go ahead and go with this let's see what we get out of it hopefully duplications is what I'm hunting for would be really nice got the old uh, Carrera there 73 model that's nice I'm happy that I've got an old-school Porsche in my last video I'm a fan of the old Porsches I did go into that a little bit so Happy I got that. Let's go ahead and open up the next one. Premium card, let's do it. All right, so what I'm hoping is, I'm hoping to get ones that are not supercar related because I've got so many supercar um, coin, or well, you know, chips that I can utilize. Got a Mustang. Oh, sorry, the SVT Cobra, my mistake. So that's, that's pretty neat. But yeah, what I'm hoping for is I'm getting openings um, that are not supercar related because I've got so much um, chips there ready to go. So yeah, there's that. So if we go into the classes here, as you can see, yeah, I've got a ton of that. So I've got five that I can open up. Let's go ahead and claim up our muscle car and see what we get out of this one as well. I figured, you know what, it's a good time. I do have a decent amount of cards and things like that that I can open up. So yeah, hopefully you guys appreciate the unboxing here, so to speak. Not too sure what I'm gonna get. I don't know what I wanna get, to be honest, but what I get is what I get. I'm happy with that. 
But so far at the moment, I haven't been um, tuning any of my cars. I know that I should, but I want to ask you guys as well. Level 10, awesome. So I've flown through a couple of levels, which is great. Um, when is a good time? I know there's a lot of you guys out there that are far way ahead of myself. So I want to ask you guys, when will be a good time to start tuning these cars, uh, these cars up when you hit a wall or whenever? Does it really matter? Let me know. All right, actually, I didn't realize. Oh, I got one of these guys that I can claim. Why not? Let's do it. Modern street card. Okay. Let's do it. Ooh, these look good. All right. Ooh, I saw a little yellow one there. So a little yellow border. I'm not too sure what that is. It's a skyline, I believe. But we get one of the common ones anyway. It doesn't matter. Happy with that. That just increases our ability to um, enter in the rival challenges and things like that, especially when you have certain uh, restriction types that you got to adhere to. So that's all well and good. But here we go. There's five of these I'm going to claim up on. What the? Oh, I reckon they should do one of those, um, you know, X amount of spins, things like that. There you go. So you've got the Porsche 918 Spider modern with the gold borders around it. If I land that, oh my God, that'd be awesome. The likelihood of this, very highly unlikely, but we're going to give it a crack. Ooh, I didn't even see that. Got another one of those Porsches. Well, that's cool. Duplication. Two stars added to my current Porsche. That's cool. Here we go. So, it, and this is what I was hoping on as well. If I, the more duplication bonuses that I get, the more benefits that I get out of it as well. So yeah, that's actually a really good thing to pick up on as well. So the more that you do this, or the more cards that you get, the likelihood that you will be able to increase the current cream, well, crop, crop of cars, I should say rather. And hopefully you might land on something really good in the process. And if you do that, then you might be able to increase your car's abilities, all those sort of good things. And you don't have to waste your uh, tuning kits on certain cars as well. So I, I reckon there's going to be some sort of balancing with the game as well, eventually, depending on how well this progresses. So I guess it's just one of those things for now that we can sort of um, have fun with, appreciate. And eventually, once it does become a thing, well, I guess that way we can start strategizing as to what we invest our time and effort into. Well, let's go ahead again, see what we can get. Okay, I just got that fella there. I don't know if there's any sort of art form or science to this where, you know, how long you want to hold on that button there before you let go. Can't honestly tell you, but it's there. More duplication bonuses coming our way as well. So the more that you get, the more that you get more cumulative to, you know, um, more chips. So, which is good. That's always a good thing. Okay. I'm hoping I do get something good because I really, really want to see that. And at least you guys can see that on camera as well. That'd be amazing. Oh no, really? Oh, are you serious? At least I got the GT. That I'm, I'm, I'm mad, but not too mad at the same time. Oh, I could have got that gold rare, super rare, or whatever that could have been. Oh, that doesn't matter. But wow. Okay. Even for a three-star GT, you can see that it didn't really increase the um, the leveling bar there. That's interesting. So the higher your status there, the the longer it's going to take for you to. Um, uh, to achieve the next star level tier, whatever whatever they're calling it, I guess. But yeah, that was yeah, a Lamborghini. Okay, that was the uh, the Centi Centi Centario Centurio. Okay, I can't pronounce that. I've, I've, I know I made a butchering of that. That's my bad. All right, let's release. See what we get. Another Porsche. Okay, another Porsche. So we got three. Duplications or two extra duplications? I can't remember at this point. But at least it's increased there. We're nearly on three star on that one there, so that's kind of cool. 
And we got another classic supercar chips, which is cool. More super tuning kits as well. And we are, well, we're halfway on the classic, which is okay. And then you got the modern supercar over there. And that's pretty much it, okay. And if I wanted to claim all of this, I could, but honestly, I don't think you guys would want to see all of that. So let's leave all that out. But we've got a few new cars, which is awesome. And hopefully we'll get some pretty good tuning potential out of these guys as well. But I'm guessing there's going to be, you know, well, there's going to be a science to this as well, especially if you want to do rivals, climb up the leaderboards, things like that, um, that you would need to sort of ensure that you guys are boosting up the right cars for the right task at hand. All right, so far, that's all good. Just double, triple checking as you normally do. So as you can see, I'm 100% in done at part one we're on to part two just want to see quickly with rivals we've got three eligible cars that we can use so the more cars that you get the more opportunity that you can climb the tier as well so i guess there's a bit of a balance effect to this as well so we're going to always do a rival run all right let's do this one and we'll see if we can win so yeah, the more cars you get, obviously the better that you're going to be in a position to climb that leaderboard. So think about that guys as well, when you're doing your unboxings and what, and what have you and all that sort of stuff. So don't be too discouraged if you don't get what you really want and things like that, because I guess in a sense quantity is good in that respect as well. So take it for what you will. Perfect. Awesome. Oh, great. Okay. We didn't get that, but I'm really far ahead. So I'm going to not use nitrous because I know obviously you get a bonus for that as well so I want to try and get enough as much perfect hits as possible I don't think that car is going to get anywhere near me anyway as it is so let's go boom and boom so he's catching up to me you know what <laughs> he was going to overtake me just as well I did hit the nitrous there I was kind of hoping that I didn't have to use it, but it is what it is. There you have it. So let's go ahead and continue. And yeah, so we've got a couple more races that we can do. I'm up to tier three. Bonus is coming my way. Love it. Keep going. What I wanted to do as well is quickly check out the story mode. And okay, so is this open? No, I don't think so. It just shows you more bonuses and benefits that you get. Cool. All right, open it up. Let's go to event one. I just want to see what it looks like, especially, you know, for you guys that haven't seen it yet, your benefit as well, as well as mine. Okay, you get some spanners there, which is cool. And you get a, oh, there's a few things happening here. Okay. So what do we got there? We've got one, two, three, four races. You know what let's see if we can pump them out i'm going to use let's take out the new porsche let's go ahead and start the event cool all right it has seen a lot but we've got three more patrons out there that have their own style let's cut it up more on the street here on street tv cool boom okay and if you guys want to sort of slow it down and watch a few, um, read a few souls, that's up to you guys. Cool, let's just collect those. Let's go and grab these. Yes, awesome. All right, let's go ahead and take this guy on. And... All right, let's live a little dangerous. See how we go with this fella here. And hopefully we shall have our victory. Okay, first time with the Porsche today. Good start. Very good start. Especially when they're a little bit higher up the rank as well. You want to make sure that you're landing those good starts so you don't have to worry about trying to play catch up or anything like that. So that's what I've sort of come to notice while 
while I've been playing the game for the, for the short amount of time that I have been. So, anyway, let's move on to the next corner. All perfect so far. A bit of lag there, unfortunately, so I sort of miscued that. It is what it is. Let's get, a, let's get ahead of, uh, of ourselves a little bit further here so we don't have to worry about that beamer catching up to us. All good. And I think we can go for gold here. I don't think we have any problems about that beamer catching up to us. But while we're here, we may as well just hit the rest of the loss and finish them off. Easy as. Perfect. So it started off good, but averaged out towards the end. What can you do? Okay. And let's move over to that. Get our little rewards. Okay. And we've got this next race up. Okay, I think you can do it again. All right. And we are on to the next race. All right, so let's switch over to the GT and take him on. So even Stephen Race tried to sort of mix it up as well, trying to prevent the cars from breaking down. So you have to use the spanners to invest. I have used it from you know a couple on a couple of occasions. Uh, what you know when I've been sort of trying to play catch up, trying to finish off and complete the previous story mode there or the previous well, chapter, if you will. And yeah, I've noticed I've tried to sort of make a, a balance in between so I don't have to make those purchases because you do spend gold on those. So gold, I think I'll, I'll try and save as much as possible just to sort of give me you know a bit of breathing room, especially if there's such an event or an allowance to buy a certain car that I really want. And I don't want, want to really miss out on a car or something like that. To that you know degree by a few gold and that's yeah that's where I'm sort of at with that but anyway cruising along pretty much finished all well and good all right no problems there I guess we'll move on to the next uh, race here all right, so my quickest way today will be here. And like I said, as always, I'll be finishing off this race. Oh, sorry, this part of the story mode a little bit in my own time. And you know what? Or what I could possibly do is I might even just interloop it into my next video. I don't know yet. Anything can happen, honestly. See how I'm feeling, of course very very bad start get distracted there looks like we're gonna um, be on a even playing field this time around so I'm gonna have to make sure that I am going to not lose of course and let's hit the perfect on that perfect again and that was interesting I pretty much had retained my full loss even though that I hit it towards um, that corner there. So I'm gonna have to sort of look into that a little bit more just to see how that sort of worked out. But we should be fine. Not gonna have a problem here. There we go. Okay, yeah, so very bad at the start, but pretty much perfect all the way. If I hit that, if I nailed that perfect start, it would have been a perfect race. But what do you do? Cool. Let's grab some of that cash. Go back up to here. If I can, yep, click it. Awesome. There we are. And it appears that we are on the last run. So I think the GT is going to take this one. Uh, well, you know what? Yeah, yes. Do the GT. Do the GT. No nonsense. Let's get it done. But 23 of those spanners there, I've just noticed, so I'm happy with that. But let's go ahead and finish this off and we'll round out this video. So hopefully you guys are actually enjoying the content here. So 
let me know in the comments if you guys want me to do other things whilst I'm playing. If there's anything that you want me to do or see or check out, let me know. Um, so far, I am enjoying my time playing the game. Um, viewership, not the greatest, but I'm hoping that will change um, as time sort of progresses on. Especially, you know, being involved in a game that's only just started, so that's officially available for everyone. And yeah, so I'd like to sort of grow with it myself. So let me know what you guys want me to do at any stage. And if I can incorporate it, I will. So any feedback is good feedback in my books. Anyway, nearly, nearly done. Will I get that? Awesome. Oop, uh, a little bit late on that, doesn't matter. But I am way out of sight. That car's not gonna get anywhere near me. And just for giggles, there we go. Let's finish it off, done. So, that is it. And, <coughs> and that's it. So, back on street. Okay. Cool. No one can match him. Get him to prove it. Okay. Cool. And for our troubles. Yeah, so you do get these offers from time to time, so it's up to you if you want to partake in that. But let's go ahead and leave it here today. Appreciate you guys as always stopping by, checking out the videos. Hit the like button, comment down below, let me know how we're doing with this. And if you guys are new to the channel, like your racing car games, consider subscribing and hitting that notification bell icon so you don't miss out on any future videos. Anyway guys, take it easy and as always, I will catch you next time.